of Fargo CW. Welcome to Valley News Live at 9. I'm Courtney Lockey. Outrage tonight in the Fargo Moorhead area. A video is circulating around on social media of a local business owner abusing his cat. Valley News teams, Reed Gregory explains what you should do if you witness animal abuse. We do want to warn you this story includes video that may be hard to watch. Separate that spinal cord, you could separate the nerves. That's a vet's reaction to this video where a Fargo business owner is seen holding his cat by the tail as well as spraying it with water for no apparent reason. It just really traumatizes them. It, it amazes me that he would even post something like that. Because number one, it's against the law, it's animal cruelty, and there are charges that can be um, pressed against him. Miranda Knudsen came upon the video while scrolling through Facebook and couldn't believe what she was watching. The audacity to post that on social media on your Snapchat when you like own a business with your name on it, um, the fact that you're so willingly to put out there that like you're willing to abuse an animal like that is just disgusting. Some are now harshly reviewing the business on Yelp, stating they won't support the business moving forward. One review even states there are other businesses who aren't abusive towards animals. Like, what's the point, dude? Just surrender it, please. Like, obviously you don't want it. Many are asking why one would commit these actions in the first place, as well as left to wonder what else has happened to the animal. A cat like that comes into a shelter like ours, it's very hard to place an animal that's been abused. Because they, they don't know, you know, who to trust. Experts say if you suspect animal abuse, try to get proof. Take pictures, take videos, get license plate numbers, get a picture of the person's face, report it to the police, report it to animal control. And are also offering some advice for the cat's owner. Get some help. You need it. In Fargo, Reed Gregory, Valley News Live. We reached out to Funk's Lawn Care about the video as well as to local law enforcement to see if they are investigating, but we haven't heard back. It's worth noting North Dakota has some of the weakest animal abuse laws in the country as animals are considered property. However, state law states any person that willingly engages in animal abuse is guilty of a Class A misdemeanor for a first offense, a second offense, and a Class C felony for a third or subsequent offense occurring within 10 years. We have a first alert weather day tomorrow. Our